Let's talk about one of the most important things leaders need to do. <clears throat> but first, why am I wearing this headband? Well, I'm in my workout room. I'm about to work out and there's gonna be a lot of sweat. So yes, <clears throat> I'm thinking about you guys. Okay, leaders, have you accepted the fact that dealing with people problems is a key part of being a leader? We have to come to terms with that. And when it comes to serving our people, one of the most important things that a leader needs to do and become is a dealer in hope. We have to be hope dealers, not drug dealers, hope dealers. Um, hope for a better future for our organization, hope for a better future for our team as a part of that same vision of a better future for our organization. And uh, here's another critical piece, I believe, uh, in where a leader needs to be a hope dealer. As a leader, as a manager, you're often having to address uh, what I would say crucial conversations or gaps in expectations. And the way we handle that is key. Look, your best people are going to make mistakes and they are, every one of us, we need correction. So when you handle that conversation, if your employee, your teammate doesn't leave that interaction with hope, it's not going to be a, bit, a good outcome. They need to have hope that my leader believes in me. Yes, we just had a hard conversation, but my leader believes in me. Um, I can do it. I can do better. I believe in this. I, I believe I can learn this new skill. All of those things we need to, even in conversations of correction, we need to sprinkle in hope so that our people are filled with hope for a better future for the, for the company and for themselves as we march on together and climb that hill and make a better future together. Be a hope dealer.